Your Ibrox debut, how was that for you? It was very nerve wracking when I was coming on, but when I got on the pitch, I just tried to play my game, just do what I was good at, keep it simple. And uh, I thought it was it was amazing, honestly. It's a dream come true. Making my debut at Far Hill and then making my home debut was just unbelievable, honestly. Describe the feeling when you got the call from the bench. Once again, I was a wee bit taken back. I didn't know that I was going to get on. Yeah. So, no, it's, it's, it's brilliant, you know what I mean? Mm. To get, even get on the bench, but to get on the pitch is just an add-on. An add and uh, cheers, cheers to the gaffer yeah. for like, having faith in me. But, like I say, I just try to play my game, just keep it simple and do as, as much as I can for the team. Yeah. You've played on that pitch before, but it did it seem a lot bigger today. Oh, it did. Uh, felt like I played a full game after. I was absolutely, I was, I was tired. But at the end of the day, just absolutely delighted to get the win. Delighted for all the boys to get the win because it was a tough game. You've got quite a good record though. Two wins in two for you now. I hopefully I can I can keep going, keep getting more game time, and keep keep winning. Has the manager spoken to you at all about next season or where he sees you and his plans, that type of thing? Uh, no, not not really, not really. I'm just taking every day as it comes. I'm just trying to work as hard as I can in training and catch the eye, and hopefully the manager the manager sees that I've got quality and I've got talent so hopefully just push on and do as much as I can the rest of this season mm -hmm. and then do as much as I can next season. Do you expect to be involved next week? Uh, I don't I don't expect anything. Like I'm like I said I'm just taking every day as it comes but I'll I'll work as hard as I can in training, whether it's with the twenties or with the first team and hopefully I'll I'll get rewards and just uh, it's up to the gaffer at the end of the day. The 20s lost a few players this week. Was it sad to see a few friends go? Uh, aye, it is, it is really sad. I've known some of the boys nine, ten years of my life, so it is, it's devastating to see them go, but I wish them all the best in their careers and I hope that they get right to the top because they're all top lads.